Hi, in this tutorial we're going to take a look at how to install your Google Analytics code directly into your WordPress site without having to go in and use the plugin. So if you decide to do this manually, this is how it works. When you get your tracking code, once you've set up your Google Analytics, you're going to scroll down, you're going to make sure that everything here is correct, including your property name, website URL, tracking status, etc. You're going to choose whether you're going to be putting in a single domain, one domain with multiple subdomains, multiple top-level domains, and if you want to include an AdWords campaign. I don't have any AdWords campaigns, so I'm just going to go ahead and tell it I'm going to be tracking a single domain right now. Now if you scroll down further, you'll see that you can paste this code into your site, and this code is changed with any of these options that you choose above. So I'm going to go in, copy this file, and I'm going to go into my WordPress hub, into Appearance, down to Editor, and I'm going to put this in the footer file. And the reason I'm going to put it in the footer file is because Google would like you to put this code in every page that you would like to have tracked. But instead of going through and putting it in every single page we do all the time, I'm going to put it into a part of the page that shows up with every page that is looked at, and that is the footer. So look for footer PHP. I'm going to scroll down, and I'm going to paste the code that I just got from Google Analytics right above the backslash body end tag just paste it in, click update file, and now every time someone comes to one of the pages on your site it will automatically go into Google Analytics so you can see how many people have been looking at it. And if you go into standard reporting, keep in mind that it's going to give you information from the day before, so that's why you see that there aren't any visits on here now because I just now installed the code. So you can also go into demographics, you can find out where the people are looking at you from, you can look at the traffic sources, including where they're coming from, if it's Google, Yahoo, if they're coming directly to you, or if they're being referred by other sites, what site content they're looking at, what site speed your site is running at, if they're doing site searches, and all kinds of other information. You can also set up custom reporting where you can choose new metrics that it will report to you. For instance, how many people click to subscribe on your RSS feed. So as you can see, even though it sounds intimidating, installing Google Analytics manually into your page is really simple. All you have to do is copy the analytics code, go into your footer.php, and paste it in right before the backslash body. And there you have it. So I hope you liked this tutorial. This is a really easy method to use, and I will see you at the next one. Thanks for listening.